Hi there. This is Mary at the Marriott TA. And it's very early on Friday morning. I'm rested. I'm doing a private stream and I will change it to public so that you can see it too. I have a little work that I want to do in my journal. Actually, let me tell you, I'm so disappointed. I spent an hour and a half sketching another face today. Let me find it here. Let me find her. I spent about an hour and a half sketching Mabel Hubbard, the wife of Alexander Graham Bell. And no idea that my internet went out. <laughs> I was filming it as a private video, and it only got the first 22 minutes. And I just had part of her sketched. But I'm very happy with the sketch in the long run. So I have some things I want to do in here. I have a lot of little scrappies that I want to start and put on another scrappy page here. Let's just do that. Uh, well, you know what? I don't know if I'll call this a scrappy page. I think I have these coins. Shall I? Well, I guess I can call it. Well, yeah. Let's just put these in here. And I'm thinking that I'm going to use these are from the fan that I made for Valentine. And I think I'm going to use them on my ATCs. I might put them in. Let's see. But let's go ahead and put these down. Let's just do things in my journal every day. So that uh, these really aren't documented. I did these for a swap. I believe I did them this year. I'm going to sign these. If I can find a pen to sign them with. Yeah. Reach, reach in here. This one may work. Let's see. I'm just going to put Mary Dale Abrams. Yeah, my pen's running out of ink, and I'm just going to put, um, hmm, I may have done these last year. I'm just, I'm just going to put uh, October, around October, I think, October of 2018. I don't remember exactly. These were left over from a swap. I could look it up, but I'm just going to put 10, 2018. This will be taped down anyway, but ten two oh one eight. 2018. This pen is ready to be discarded. 10 2018. Or I'll check that out <laughs> before I discard it. Let's see. Um, I have some other things that I actually want to put down in here too. Part of my ladybug stuff. I've got some some vellum here. Oh, that vellum could go underneath of the equipment. Maybe I'll save that for another page where I cut. Um, got some little vellum pieces, though. I've been saving my scrappies to put them down. Now I'm reaching for them. These, I think I'm going to use on my ATC pages. There's a Valentine. That part of my Valentine. I think, I think, oh, I'm going to put these in here. These are part of a, these are more personal, but I'm going to put them in my envelope. So um, 
what you want to do when you keep a journal like this is don't just do a page and forget it. Work in it a little every day. And as you work in it every day, by the end of the month, you have this nice big fat journal with all sorts of stuff in it. And that's what I'm finding with mine. Let's see, how do I want to put this? I think I'll leave the scrappy showing. I'm going to put that there. And put this up here and that there, that there. Yeah. That I think I will just throw away. Little Valentine, we'll put that up there. <laughs> oh dear. Okay. I'm going to save that down for another day. What's this? I'm going to throw that away. And let's just tape some of these down. Uh, tape it here. And here. And a little bit here. Might as well just put these in my journal to keep them because I keep moving them from one spot to another. And this way I'll have them, even though they were from last year, I'll have them. These are just extras that I made. I'll have them in a journal. <laughs> that is my thought. And let's just put this down. And let's put this one down. Oh, this tape. I'm hope I'm live. It looks like I am. I did not realize that my internet stopped. I wasted an hour and a half of filming or it stopped on me. And I learned a lesson there to check to see if the little clock is going. Because if the clock's not going, if it's not counting down the minutes for me, I have no way of knowing if I'm connected or not. All right, let's go ahead and put these in. This is scrap page. This is from my ladybug. This is too, just too pretty to throw away. Little scrap things. I got some others that I'm going to use, but just too pretty to throw away. I'll put that in later. Just adds a little charm to my journal. Little color, little sparkle. And the reason I'm doing this now is that I'm awake, but also uh, I will be going live tomorrow night. So I want to get some things done before my live stream tomorrow night. I have a list. I know exactly what I'm going to do. I never run out of things to do, let me tell you. Let's just put this right in here, right there. This here. These were kind of extra ones that I had that I did not send out. I was in an ATC coin swap. I think it was a fall one. It might have been either October or September or October of 2018. I think I'll put this one down here. So Valentine's Day is come and gone. Another year. Where's that little heart? Here, let's put him. Let's put him right in here. 
I didn't use him because I thought he looked a little sad. <laughs> no, I didn't want him on my fan looking unhappy. Yeah. So this is not just an art journal. It's kind of like a day journal. But I do a lot of art in it. But I keep track of my days, as you can see here. And I don't plan. It's not a planner. But I keep track of, okay, on next Wednesday, um, the 20th at 12 noon, on Jerry Bellini, Recycle Parts for Art, her and Tanya and Lisa are doing a project. And then the next day, the 21st, Becky and Mary and Linda McAllister on Linda's channel, we're doing a hangout. So I kind of write these to remind me. And then I note when I do my live streams and maybe what I did that day. Let's flip over here to... I think I have a page of ATCs that I need to do. These were my last. I want to stamp. I want to stamp and get it out here. How did I do with my heart stamp? I still have a squeaky chair. Where's my heart stamp? I keep misplacing that heart stamp. I want to stamp my hearts down the line there and I keep and get it out and then I move it. Do you ever do that with stuff? And then I lose track of where I move it to. I've got my little birds. I could do that instead. Here it is. I want to put my hearts down the border here. And I'm going to do that with um, red ink. Let's just do it now because it's February. And it may stamp uneven, but that's because this is a journal. I'm not sending this out or anything. Oh, I'm stamping it in black. Well, that's okay. We'll stamp it in black. There's still hearts. See, it's stamped uneven there. That's okay. Can I get that heart in there? There. Now I'm happy. So I'm just, I'm just working in my journal. Um, I think I want to go to my next ATC page. These are my doodles. We're going to do a doodle game five tomorrow night in my live stream. And I will say, uh, if you use that double-sided tape in your journal, even I've been testing this, and I find that as I flip these pages back and forth and back and forth, this stuff tends to come out. I think it will be okay in my Word journal because I don't flip my pages back and forth so much. So, yes, I'm filling this up. All right, this is my next set of ATCs. What I want to do is just start. I should probably put some paint. Shall we go with the red paint again? I found my crimson. I found my crimson paint. So let's go with that. Let's put my tape away here. Let's get my scraper out. Oh, where's the other one? Get, I'm getting my scraper. Yeah. This just gives it a little background. on the ATCs.
and I can still see the I can still see the lines of where I'm putting things. sides here. Yeah. That's going to be yucky. I'm going to need just a touch more. Yeah. There we go. It dries pretty fast when you scrape it like this. I think it was Kimberly who said, there's just... Kimberly 557, there's just something relaxing about scraping paint across your page. Now, let me wipe this off. Try to get in the habit of cleaning my paint off before I close it up. Then I won't have that goo when I open it that I hate so much there. There. And I see that I'm kind of crooked here. Is my camera crooked? My camera crooked here. Let's straighten it out and go up a little. There. And of course, my page is curling. And I don't mind that it gets on my other pages. That does not bother me, it just makes it prettier. Right, if you will. Put that in the gutter there. do have a smaller as I get more pages in here they tend to bulk open on me now I think I'll work on some ATCs I wasn't going to but I think I will I'm going to put some of this pretty trim and I think I'll start out just by doing this and putting them on the bottom And I just like doing these in my journal. I don't really swap these out, but they help me use up my scraps. Like I, these ribbons are, uh, this ribbon is uh, when I made my fan that was cast off. It was the trim that I didn't use. Let's trim it off here if I can. And probably about to, there. And I'm just going to put it here. And 
I call these little windows of art. I need to bring my other little scissors in here. There we go. Let's do this one. Just a little. This is fun to do. Very fun to do these. I was thinking I should get up and go get my needlework magazines and do some more needlework ATCs. We'll see what we have here. I need another ribbon. There. I have a lot of scraps that need to be used up. I might just make some scrap ones here. Some scrappy ATCs. I cleaned out my little hobby cart that Lucia gifted me. Oh my goodness. How things accumulate. How things accumulate. And I have a lot of little scrappies that just have accumulated in there. <laughs> oh dear so maybe I should just make some scrappy ATCs rather than needlework ones let's see what I have here I saved them I saved them right within reach and you know what though mm, let me reach over here this would look pretty on there here's a piece of leather from Papa Pierre, here's some scrapbook paper. This is an envelope from, uh, actually that came from Peg Robinson. This one came from Ruth. Ooh, I'm saving this for my March. I'm saving this for my March journal, February, March. Be very pretty. I got this. I don't really care for that. Oh, look. Oh, my goodness, they're all... Look, I have another stack of coins here. I just have all sorts of stuff that accumulated in that hobby. Look, I've got some more ATC coins. Just all sorts of little scraps that need to be some little bits of lace. Let's make some scrap ATCs. <laughs> I don't know if I'll put that in there, but there it is. Here's a, I cut a stencil. I think I'll save that. And a piece of denim. It's another piece of fabric. Another fall leaf. And a piece of, a piece of white paper. Let's see. I think I'm liking this envelope. Uh, I didn't want to send it out. I didn't like it as far as the painting, but I like, I think I'll save the trim from it. Let's see if I can. It got glued closed. Let's see. Uh, let's see if I can deconstruct this envelope here in a reasonable amount of time. It's a bubble envelope. Let's just cut it. Oh, I don't want to do that. Well, I'll have to cut it in there. See, I did not like this area. I don't mind the 
the tatted edges are okay with me, but this was not working for me, so I quit. <laughs> I never did send it out to anybody. I don't mind that so much. Hmm. I've got bubble envelope here. I don't know if I can... Mary's got scraps. Mary has scraps. It might make it fairly puffy, but let's see. Let's we're not gonna use that. I might use this. Not gonna use that. How about <laughs> that's sticky. <laughs> Let's put that over here on my scrap page. <laughs> I have it here. Is this it? This is it. Oh, it'll fit too. Let's tear it. Put it underneath. Let me up. Yeah. Let's put this right there. All right, just like that. <laughs> now I got all this to move back over. These are some stickers. I think these came from Gina. I might use those from way back in those days. Let's see, let's cut it here. And Maybe right there. And trim it just a bit more. Yeah. Now let's put that came from my grandniece's kindergarten. You all helped make our year in kindergarten special gonna say that let's see I'm thinking one of this in here um just a can't find the start of it just a piece of it might be too much really kind of pretty though. It's kind of hard to cut this kind of a nylon netted fabric. Yeah. What that is. I'm going to skip some tape. I sure hope I'm live here. I should turn on my phone and see. No, I'm private. I probably can't see. Well, there you go. We'll find out. Now I'm going to put this in here like that. <sighs> Where's my...
This is the bubble envelope. <laughs> We'll see if it sticks. I just like using up all these little scraps. This will be scrappy ATCs, but and be surprised they they come together. Uh, get them off of here though. Get the might have been better to put it down on the paper. We are getting it. One more. There we go. Now, let's put... These are kind of interesting. What do I have here? I have a... Ooh. I like that. I have those from from Jerry too. It might fit right in there. I'll save those out. That is. These are painted paper ATCs or um, ATC coins out of a drop sheet that I had. It's kind of interesting. I don't know if I want to use all of those. I'll use some of them. Let's use that there and this here. Yeah, I'll just cut this. Me too. Do I want it shorter? No, I think I want these to come down right there. These come together pretty fast. Get my finger, my <laughs> fingers glued to my finger. Come on, get off of me. <laughs> Make sure that, yeah, that might be a little much. I think I can take it off of the, can I take it off of here? There we go. Do I want to put one of these in here? Maybe one with the circle? Yeah. 
I'm still thinking about that. I got the blue denim. These others have some interest to them on the back side. Not all of them have, uh, not all of them are punched. I guess that's just one. <sighs> Let's get another piece of Like that, maybe? Yeah. I want something under it. Do I not have enough scrap? Oh, here, this is perfect. This is perfect. Let's cut this. I'm sure this was sent to me in Happy Mail, but I don't know who from. There we go. And let's scrap. Let's go ahead and take these off. Scrappy ATCs, yeah. And we want this to fall right about in. There. Oh, and I'm going to have to put another piece of tape down. Put it on here. Oh, 
not there. Yeah, I like that. I'm not sure I like these. I'll use them for another another day. I have a lot of them. I think I punched out an entire drop sheet. Let's see. I got the Liberty Bell. Yeah. Nothing there. Not there. What do I want there? Another one of these? No. I still say they could make this tape better for us. I like the tape. It's just sometimes hard to get that release paper off. Yeah. Let's 
put this right in here. I want to put let's put it soft side up. And let's put this. We got a wild cat. A stray tomcat. <laughs> oh, Mary's laughing at herself. It's a tomcat. All right. Uh, let's use this. Well, we do have stray cats that roam. I hope that they're in out of the cold. We're supposed to get snow. Snow and cold, snow and cold. It just keeps coming. I think I'll leave it like that. Snow and cold, snow and cold. That's what winter's all about. Unless to be here for a reason. Actually, I get a lot done in the winter time. I get enough, a lot done in the wee hours of the morning. Get a lot done in the wee hours of the morning. I didn't plan on doing this when I started my stream. <laughs> I didn't use all my scraps. That's for sure. I created a lot of scrap. All of these. And yeah, I'll throw these away. I'll throw that away. Yeah. What that is. A key. might come in handy sometime for something I forgot about. All righty. Oh, I see it's coming up there. I need some tape on there. Well, that didn't help. Now, what am I going to use with focal images? Yep.
Yeah, I like that. about putting that there and this over here and I'll have it like that I wouldn't be surprised when we opened our curtains tomorrow morning if there would be snow on the ground. I'll put that right in here. And this... Like that. Like that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's what winter is all about. I didn't intend to do these. What you're looking underneath of my book here, you'll see all those postcards. That's what I intended to work on when I start started this stream. And this is just a private stream. But I've been going for about an hour. What time is it? It's almost four o'clock. I could close off my private stream and start a, a live stream, a public one, and cut my postcards, and what else could I do? I have a stamp that I want to carve. Hmm. Maybe I'll do that. I think I wanted it like this. And then I'll just show this one later in the afternoon. Now, I'm liking that, but I have all of this stuff left. Let's gather it up. That's what I kept that white envelope up for, to hold this. Keep that out. This is so pretty. I'm 
Liberty Bell. And I think I think I'll just wrap this around like this. Maybe I could send this to some happy mail. <laughs> but I'm not sending out that envelope. It's going in my March journal. All righty. Let's see what I have here. Scraps. Scraps. I want to put this in here. Maybe here. I'll put it right in here. You all help to make Our year in kindergarten special. <laughs> I came off of the program of my grandniece's kindergarten graduation, and she's in second grade now. That's how long I've had this. I think I did an art journal page last year of her kindergarten years. Her using her kindergarten program. All right, let's get the rest of these little scraps up. All right. Now I want to mark her. But before I do that, I think I'm going to Stamp more hearts. What did I do with my heart stamp? <laughs> Come on. Here it is. I'm going to stamp hearts in here. I am just not ready to quit. I could just art all week. How fun this is. How fun this is. Don't miss out on the fun of doing this. This is just scrap. This is just scrap. Just scrap and an eraser stamp. I'm using Dranger's Archival Ink. It's just how fun. Journal that I put together myself out of old paper. And I'm just having, well not old paper, copy paper. It was not a journal that I paid $50 for. Although I'd like to get a custom keeper keep them all in but we'll see 
I think it's in the works. How fun. <laughs> How fun that was. Now, I want to mark them off. Hopefully this is juicy enough. And it is. Let's mark it off here. I call these my little windows of art. Little windows of art. These don't have to be exactly exact because they're in my journal. But they're just about... <laughs> Two and a half by three and a half. And by the time I put my marks on here, it might expand them a little. But to tell you the truth, if I were to cut these out, I'd probably cut them down to size. Just having fun. I'm sure tempted to go live, but I probably shouldn't. I'll be going live tonight. So that must means that I'll work just a little bit longer here because I want to cut these postcards and get them ready to mail. I'll be giving away some in my stream tonight. Yeah. Let's make this one a little darker. I don't know if that's going to hold or not. Now, you might ask, what's the object of doing this other than to make ATCs? Well, I used up all those scraps. Not all of them, but I used up some of them. And I'll just keep using them. So I did that. And you didn't see the video where... Uh, where did Her Majesty go to? Oh, here. Mrs. Alexander Graham Bell. I sketched her tonight, but the internet went down, and I'm sure hope that it's going now. <laughs> and then I did these ATCs, and I glued this down, and I glued some scraps in here. So my journal is growing. Today is, well, it's the 15th now, so... I've got two weeks. I've been working on my sketch a days, my fib sketch a day. Um, these are the first six. And I did the lady there. I got some to catch up on. But that's for another video. I don't really video those. I just, I have fun sketching them. Sitting in my recliner. 
so look how bad it's getting. <laughs> It's okay to grow fat journal. There we go. <sighs> but by the time I get 12, they're going to be pretty pretty thick, at least 12 inches. I'll probably have to have two covers. I'll probably have to have two. We'll see. So now what I want to do, I'm not quite ready to sign off. I want to cut these postcards. And I'm going to cut it right here, right down here. And do I have my utility knife? I think my blade is still sharp enough. We shall see. Here it goes. There we go. A little bit in here. Yeah. Now, let's see. Get my trimmer. I think, yes, will they fit? Just barely. Oh, I wanted to save that. Now, this one and this one, the ones with the bluebirds on them, are staying with me. And this one here is staying with me. So I'm going to cut those out. This one's staying with me. I'm going to cut those out and keep them with me. And the others, I'm going to send out. I've already given six away in my morning stream on Thursday morning and on my Friday night I'm going to give six more away am I good I think I am well it's a little short maybe I should trim this No, I might have to trim that with my knife or darken it. Maybe I'll darken it with my, I might have to trim that. And let's see. I don't know. Will these fit in here? Just barely. But I think they will. Postcards are only 35 cents to send out. So you might see me making a lot more postcards for Happy Mail. Now these were done 
Wednesday night in Aunt Beck's Creations live stream. Yeah. And then I finished them up today. Well, <laughs> Thursday. It's Friday now. There we go. And I'm going to ink the edges. And I'm leaving the little blotches. I'm leaving those. Let's just be how they are. I put a little heart marshmallow on these. little heart in there. This one's really got a nice heart. Now let's cut them up. Let's cut them apart. This is the one I need to trim. Let's trim this. I need to trim it. I did not do a good job. There. That's better. So sending out 15 postcards at 35 cents would be what? 35 times 15. Well, 35 times 10 would be 350. And half of 350 would be what? $1.25? So it'd be a little under five dollars to send them out. That's not bad. Gosh, you send that much. You send that much for one sometimes. One happy meal, <laughs> depending on what's in it. So you might see me making a lot more postcards. And these have, these have uh, white paint on them. I might do a satin, I might do a satin uh, coating on this. I don't know this, if this is going to chip. I, it may chip a little, but I think it'll be okay. I'll think about it. <laughs> And I wish you could see the sheen of that glitter. It's really a pretty glitter glue. So I am just playing. I have nothing to, I have to laugh at Lisa Conway sometimes. She says, I feel like I should be telling you great stories, but I have nothing. <laughs> uh, I have nothing. There's nothing I want to tell you. <laughs> and she does good work. I love her pick tens. Now I'm doing the pick tens in my journal. And the Dirty Dozens I use for postcards and art journals and ATCs and all sorts of things. There we go. Now, I think it is these two and that one that I'm keeping. So I'm going to cut these out and put them aside so I don't get them mixed up with everything else. That's this one. The birds I'm not worried about getting mixed up because they're pretty, I pretty well 
no, but they're goofy. I was thinking about painting them out, but then I thought, no, I'll just keep them. And last one. Okay, so let me move my mat because I'm not going to do any more cutting. These are the ones I'm going to, I've given six of these away. I've given three to three people that I want to thank. Oh, that bird goes there. This bird goes here. And I'm going to give six away tonight. So one, two, three, one, two, three, or five, six. There should be six here. One, two, three, four, five, six. So what I want to do next, and I'm going to... I'm going to use minus test. I want. I have a postcard stamp here. All it says is postcard. And I'm going to stamp it up here. I feel like masking out the stamp. I think I will. Hmm. I have to mask it out on the paper. Well, get a piece of paper. A piece of copy paper here. And I need some waxed paper. I'm just here playing. <laughs> I'm going to stop turning off the computer till I'm done. <laughs> so, uh, I don't want that. Uh, I'm going to stamp all of these. And I'm just going to take this and put it right up in here. Because I don't want that to stamp to stamp off. I might put it down a little. Because these are not. There. All right, let's try it. This is my bird. Maybe I'll send these to myself anyway. All right. And I think I've inked up my stamp enough. Re-inked my stamp that it's still ju juicy. That's why I put my wax paper down. Because I'm continually dropping these. All right, let's try it on mine. Uh, press down on it. This is water. So, I have 18 of these to do. Do you want to watch me?
or should I close this out? I think I should close out my video and finish these off camera, but you get the idea. Let me finish this one. Yeah. I'm liking. So I'm going to go ahead and let's see. I will. Let me show you what I'm going to do here. I'm going to take my pen marker here. And I'm going to edge them. I'll edge it here. as a sample and I'll probably have to edge this will give me something to do today edge all of these 18 of them that's why I'm thinking about closing out my camera because it can become quite boring there And then I'll edge it on the back. Now, I'm thinking that I will go ahead. Let me show you. I might have to re-ink my stamp pad before I get done here. And this one's coming to me, so I'm not too particular about it. This black line. I'd be a little bit more particular on the others, but I just want to get this done. There. And what I'm going to do is grab my Penelope stamp. And let's ink her up. And I think I have enough room that I can just put her right here. Yeah. yeah. And then I have to always take a pen and because she she her eyes need to be fixed. I just kind of ink in her eyes. There we go. And then I'll put a message on it. I'll say, hi, Mary. Hag. And artful, F-U-L-L, day. And I sign it down here and uh, let's put the Mary Atelier. I'm going to send this one to myself. It's one of those birds. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to go off camera and finish these. And we'll get them ready to mail out. And I'm going to give six more away tonight in my live stream. So thank you for watching. And I will see you on the next page.